Congratulations on your new Apollo Solo. In this video, we'll cover how to set up your new interface, including downloading and installing the UAD software, registering your Apollo to your account, and authorizing your included UAD plugins. To get started, connect your Apollo Solo to a Thunderbolt 3 port on your computer using a Thunderbolt 3 compatible USB-C cable. The term USB-C refers to the shape of the connector used by these cables, while Thunderbolt 3 refers to the way that the Apollo Solo communicates with the computer. Not all USB-C cables support Thunderbolt 3, so be sure to check compatibility before purchasing any cables for your Apollo Solo. Look for the Thunderbolt icon printed on the connector, or check the specifications listed on the cable manufacturer's website. Beware of USB-C charging cables and cables that only support USB 3 or 3.1. These cables look similar to the Thunderbolt 3 versions, but they do not have the Thunderbolt icon printed on the connector and will not work with Apollo Solo. Both active and passive Thunderbolt 3 cables can be used, with no differences in performance between either type of cable. Check out the cable guide at help.uaudio.com for more info about cable compatibility. Once you've connected your Apollo Solo to your computer, you're ready to download and install the UAD software. The UAD software download contains all drivers and plugin files that you'll need to use your Apollo Solo and UAD plugins, as well as two applications. The UAD meter and control panel, which is used to manage UAD plugin authorizations and system settings. And console, which is used to access Apollo Solo's real-time UAD processing and monitoring features. Go to uaudio.com forward slash downloads to get the latest version of the UAD software. You'll need to log in to your UA account to download the software. If you don't have a UA account yet, click the Create an Account link to set one up. Creating an account is free and is required to register your Apollo Solo and claim your included UAD plugins. You can also download Luna for free. Luna is a full-featured recording system that seamlessly integrates with your Apollo and offers unique features like integrated multi-track tape and console summing. Visit uaudio.com forward slash Luna for more info. Once the download is finished, locate the file in your downloads folder and double click on it to extract. When the extraction is complete, double click on the resulting file to start the installer. Continue by following the on-screen instructions, making sure to enter your password and click OK on the Mac OS notifications when prompted. When you reach the last page of the installer, you'll see a notification that the UAD software must be allowed in System Preferences after restarting. Dismiss the notification, then click the Restart button to reboot your computer and complete the installation. Make sure that the Apollo Solo remains powered on and connected to your computer during this process. After restarting, a notification will appear to remind you that the UAD software must be allowed in System Preferences. Click the Open Security Preferences button in the notification window. Then click the Allow button at the bottom of the General tab in the Security and Privacy window. If you don't see the Allow button right away, you may need to click the lock icon in the bottom left corner and enter your password to access it. This must be done within 30 minutes of installation, otherwise you'll need to reinstall the UAD software and repeat these steps. If the software is not allowed, the UAD meter will display Driver Not Installed Correctly and the Apollo Solo will not function properly. After allowing the software, your web browser will launch and connect to the UA website to complete registration and claim your included UAD plugins. When you're finished with registration, the next step is to authorize your included UAD plugins using the UAD Meter and Control Panel application. Click the blue UAD2 button to open the Plugins panel, then click the Authorize Plugins button to authorize your UAD plugins. UAD plugin authorizations are stored on your Apollo Solo so you can access your plugins from any compatible system that has the UAD software installed, as long as your Apollo Solo is connected. Your Apollo Solo and UAD plugins are now registered, and you're ready to start making music. Check out our other videos for help configuring your DAW, using the console application, and more.